Hello guys, my name is Noah Merby, and in this video, we're going to talk about what neuroplasticity is and how you can use it. The fundamental idea that you need to keep in mind when thinking about neuroplasticity is the following. Neurons that fire together, wire together. Scientists believed for the longest time that our brain doesn't change and that once we hit a certain point in adulthood, our brain would stop developing. But a scientific breakthrough in neurology brought up this amazing concept called neuroplasticity. And scientists found that the brain actually never stops developing and it is constantly changing on a physical and chemical level. So the brain is made out of billions and billions of neural structures all interconnected together and that guide us through our everyday lives. So when we face a situation and we react in a certain way over and over again, this will eventually create a neural structure. So at one point, every single time we face this situation, the neural structure is automatically activated and we react in the exact same way we are used to react. So neuroplasticity explores this side of our brain that is plastic, our side of our brain that is actually changeable, that you can change physically and chemically. And the thing is, even if you already formed a neural structure, you can always change it or break it. So picture the brain as a map. All the neural structures that are formed through our, our lives, every thought, action, emotion, and behavior we went through made this map of neural structures that is now in our head. And the thing is, we can either follow this map or we can change this map. Every time we do the same action or we have the same thought, we are reinforcing this neural structure. We are reinforcing this pathway in our brain. But when we start acting or reacting differently, we start creating a new pathway. And if we keep repeating the process, this new pathway will become the new dominant pathway that predicates our action, thoughts, behaviors, and emotions. And the old pathway will be used less and less and less until the neural structure breaks. And this brings us to another main neuroplasticity concept, which is use it or lose it. If you use the pathway over and over and over again, you're gonna make it wire, neurons that fire together, wire together. But if you don't use it, you will lose it. This neural structure, this pathway will break and your thought patterns, behaviors, and emotions will start being predicated based on the new pathway, the new neural structure. And this process is called the brain rewiring and we all have the ability to rewire our brain, but it just takes a little bit of focused action, repetition, and consistency. Think about a bad habit that you had at one point in time that you changed into a good habit. This is you rewiring your brain. Think about a bad behavior that you did over and over and over again that eventually became a habit. This is you also rewiring your brain. This is you creating a new neural structure, a new pathway per se. So with consistent, repetitive, and focused action, you can rewire your brain. You can change your thoughts, your thought patterns, your behaviors, your habits, your emotions, your emotional stability and control. You can rewire everything. Your brain is plastic. You can actually change its physical and chemical form if you use the principles of neuroplasticity properly. And all it takes is repetitive action towards you, breaking the old neural structure that you had and forming a new neural structure. Stop using the old pathway that you are using over and over and over again and use a new pathway that will become a new neural structure that predicates your actions, thoughts, and behaviors. So to sum it up, you gotta keep two principles in mind. First, neurons that fire together will wire together. And the second principle, use it or lose it. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up and hit the subscribe button below.